<laughs> Ooh, it's getting warm. Yeah, I'm in uh, bright sunny Karuna, Sweden in the north, inside the Arctic Circle. Heading towards the famous ice hotel. So I think it's gonna get warmer in there. Yeah, I think it's gonna be very toasty. Walking to the bus stop now. Uh, it's one in the afternoon. It's gonna be dark soon. And uh, it's about 20 below Celsius. I think that's negative 11 Fahrenheit. Ice hotel, the famous ice hotel. So I'll go into a little bit of the background of that story. It's just quite cool. Uh, this gentleman, I can't remember his name, uh, just decided to build it. He was doing something else. I can't remember. He had some other whole career. The reason this ice is so special is it's cut from a lake. So it doesn't have a feather in it. It doesn't have any weakness in it. Like that little white part of an ice cube or it's the same white part if you're doing ice carving professionally. It's got this feather in it, it's called in the middle. And it's a point of weakness. So if you're doing any carving or anything, it's you gotta take it into account. Now this stuff, as we'll see later, is perfectly translucent, which is quite uh, quite rare. Uh, that's it. I mean, that's it's just waiting for the bus. Oh. Yeah. Taxis are not too cheap. They are like 20 euros to start to go anywhere. So we're gonna do public transportation. Definitely. Hope I'm in the right spot. Check out my friend there. <laughs> yes, those are chickens you hear in the background. Some sick fucker made a chicken coop out of ice. WTF.